more than a generation, Amway's been building a tradition of quality and value any company would be proud to claim. And its founding principles remain as strong and relevant today as ever. Let's take a quick look back and you'll see what I mean. What were the things that really made a difference? And I want to share with you the four fundamentals that we think today as we look back at this business are what built this business and hold the business together. Now, fundamentally, and the first one is the simple word freedom. Freedom. The freedom to be what one wishes to be, to live where one wishes to live, to support the causes one believes in, to explore the full and exciting range of one's potential. Not many people ever experience that kind of freedom. It's a rare, uncommon freedom which must be won, must be earned. It's the result of one's own individual effort and vision. We offer freedom. We offer rewards. We offer recognition. And we offer hope. And so we go to countries like Korea or we go into Hungary and as we march across Eastern Europe, it is no wonder they will stand in line to join the Amway business. Because you offer them freedom to own their own business. You see, we never looked at poverty or poorness or a class system. We looked at it as a stage you pass through and that many of us were poor. We just chose not to stay there. And so we moved through it and went on. And that's the freedom you have, that you can move beyond where you are. And that was the freedom we felt that we were touching to empower, to take charge of their life and change. So that dream is a reality for us today, all over the world for millions of people who discovered it with us. Well, the second theme I would talk about of the four is family. Rich and I believe that it's extremely important to perpetuate the philosophies and ideas that have been built into this company. We believe that the family members can bring that into play probably better than anybody else. We want family. We want people who cheer us on. We want people when we come home and nobody showed up for the meeting to say, that's okay, we'll get them next week. We'll do another meeting tomorrow. You can do it. Well, the third point of what we worked at when we developed the plan was rewards. We've learned that Amway principles translate into many languages and transcend many cultures. Being rewarded in proportion to how much you do is a universal language for people around the world. For many people who come through your groups, the rewards will not be in this plan. The rewards will be in how you impact their life and how they go out with a whole new attitude about who they are and their sense of worth. That's one of the greatest things you do, and that's one of the greatest rewards you'll ever get. Well, let me finish. It's the last one. And the last one is hope. But then 30 years ago, I never dreamed that Ada would be Amway's world headquarters either. So. It's important to look ahead with optimism and unlimited potential. Our goal must be to make the lonely and the frustrated and the scared have that sense of hope and security that we can bring them. That's why you're here. And that's what we're all about. We have to believe in ourselves. You can't predict the future, but you can follow your dreams. These are qualities of leadership that centuries cannot change. No matter what changes the future brings, the human heart and the human mind remain unchanged.